Daddy Roxo with another video. So we coming up to Kansas. We we um hit the border to Kansas. There's a bunch of pig pens over there. There's some silos coming up. We're on Highway 5. Um, it'll tell the highway in a minute. But we're in Clarks, Kansas. Some pretty big silos back here. I'm not sure what they have stopped in there. Some kind of weed, I guess. Some looks like a bunch of farmland out here. Uh, the sun has come up. I don't feel so queasy anymore. I kind of woken up a little bit. Roxa with another video. <laughs> hey y'all, I just wanted to show y'all these um, turbines. Coming up on a turbine field. Oh, look at that. Sun coming up. We're in Kansas City, Clark's Kansas City. We're on Highway um, 56. always have a little barn in the middle of them. I guess that's where they store the energy or whatever. And those, um, those blades are huge. They're bigger than, they're longer than the length of this tra trailer, the whole truck. The closer we get, you can see how big they are. At night, all you see is a red light. A sea of red lights, but they're quite big. So you see that car? And you can give you an idea how big they are. They are huge. No, they're not windmills. They are, they're called turbines.
They need to do that with the oil. It's, it's beyond me why this country is still dependent on other countries for energy. That makes no sense to me. And then they can charge you whatever they want. It just has that eerie feeling to me. Like somebody been paid off or bought out or something. Somebody selling out. Well, we should be energy sufficient by now. wanted y'all to see the turbine feel got a little parking area over there which is great if you're tired and sleepy somewhere you can park and that's another thing they coming up with all these regulations and nowhere to park you can't pull on the side of the road the park the truck uh, truck stops are full not complaining it just is There's Miss Diva laying on her pillow. Sleepy. Miss Diva sleeping. Huh, cow pastor. another one of my tips I love this if you can see it so I took um, it comes with a little scoop kachaga comes with this little scoop right here powder and I put it in here in my little cup Put it in here. 
talk about energy and my little blend jet. I love the blend jet. That's another good tool. Pull the top off and drink. Good investment. Um, I forget what this bag costs. It's like a meal in a bag. A shake. Um, I noticed that I'm not as hungry when I drink it. And it gives me a ton of energy. And I don't be worrying about food all day. So I just wanted to give you guys that tip. 